running today because yesterday we we ate so much pizza right yeah cheat day and stuff so we're about to just get like 10k or 5k done what are you saying maybe four <laughs> <laughs> they're friends come Hi, friend, okay? come welcome to london you see them everywhere. Okay, so it's interval time and we're gonna keep doing this now for about 10, ooh, 10 times. I made it through 65% of my pregnancy literally and the baby is like one kilo now so it feels real and the kicks are getting stronger like the kicks are so strong like sometimes it kicks my um, urine thingy inside where my urine is and I just have to run to the toilet otherwise I'm gonna like pee myself I'm serious even that's crazy um, <laughs> yeah it's funny and it's really annoying because I pee more than ever during the night now. Like tonight, I think I was up five times before. So, so that's the little problem because I don't get like full long nights of sleep. Yeah, so then we went for a run, me and Romeo, and it felt so good as I'm feeling more energized now that I'm taking my iron. So that's nice. Um, the only problem is my lower back like that's the only thing killing my vibe right now like my lower back is so painful it's not serious like it's a tingling feeling going from on the right hand side of my lower back and the like top of my bum and then all the way down in my bum and all the way down in my back of, in the back of my thigh especially the right one um, it's like my pelvic um, messing with me and that is not fun I'm telling you like oh, we have this machine luckily that gives you like electric electric signals like um, pulsing that I can attach to my back and then I start it and it's like a program you can choose that is like half an hour long and that really helps I do that every evening kind of because it were it was recommended if you have pelvic problems or you can also do like um, what's the name hmm. the needles um, acupuncture slow it's, it's taking time but it's coming um, yeah so now I feel like Romeo he always had lower back problems so now I really feel for him poor guy he's feeling that all the time like at least hopefully mine will be over once the baby is out so um, I just have to last for a few more months I'm literally 26 weeks today that's crazy 65% done from the pregnancy. Only 98 da days left. I've studied, I've studied. Um, my lips are so dry. Like, I keep putting Vaseline, all of these different lips, lip creams, but nothing is helping. I keep putting it like every half an hour and still again the next half an hour they're like dry as paper it's crazy like it's falling off oh but my nails are better like i've always had kind of kind of bad nails but they are much harder and they're not peeling off as much as they usually do so thumbs up for that um what else um hmm. i think we might go for a little walk just to calm down my back it feels better when it's like warmed up. I can't sit down for too long. I'm like, 
an old lady. I can't sit down too much. Like I can, but the problem is, our so like in our living room here in London, we don't have a dinner table. We only have like the sofa and the TV table and the TV. So I have to sit like that and eat. And it doesn't make my back better. I need to sit straight. Try to put like a pillow under my bum to like get it straight, but it's gonna be good. Three weeks left and we're moving to Malmö in Sweden. I'm excited, I'm happy. I mean, it's like a new period in life. It's gonna be good. Not that I'm so excited about Sweden in, gen in general, but to live close to family and friends, it's gonna be so nice. And to calm down, like I feel like, as soon as I step outside the door, there is like people running around everywhere. Like London is so busy. When I moved here five years ago, it was not at all the same. But we live so close to Soho now. So it's literally like central, central London. So um, just outside my door, people is running around like maniacs. And I'm like <laughs> trying to keep up the pace and I can't. So it's tiring and it's like stressful. It's not good for either me or the baby. So it's going to be good to go to Malmö. There is like... I don't even know how many people live there, <laughs> but I think like 300,000 or something. A few years ago it was 300,000, but it might be more now. Um, but it would be nice. We got a four bedroom flat that we're gonna stay in for the first year probably, and then we'll see what we do. If we decide to stay or if we decide to move somewhere else, like life you know life happens and we'll see what happens no plans i mean the f the the half year coming is kind of planned because it has to be but we're kind of spontaneous me and Romeo. but we'll see how that changes when we have a baby so. once relaxing after the run i used my muscle stimulator and um, it really helped me for my back pain now during pregnancy size of your of a finger got bigger in a matter of two weeks. 